Colin, a frustrating night, I suppose, here at Turners Cross. Yeah, no, it was. It was. Um, yeah, we um, we got a good goal through Kevin O'Connor. Um, we conceded a, um, a soft goal from our point of view. Um, we should have done better with the uh, with the corner. But um, you got to give credit for Wexford. They came down. Um, they played well. Uh, they moved the ball quickly and caused us problems. But um, it was just one of those games tonight. We weren't at it, and do you know it's um, it was a difficult night for us. Do you know maybe a, maybe a point was um, a fair result. You predicted during the week that Wexford would be up for it. That they're they're a decent side, and like they came out of the block straight away at the start of the game. They they looked well up for from from the off really. No, they did. They did. Um, and we changed our system. Um, and um, we knew that they'd play the diamond, so we we think we'd, we'd get them in wide areas. But we didn't look after the ball as good as I thought we would. Um, we get the goal from from wide area. Kevin getting in the back post, which is great, but we didn't do that enough. Um, we had some good chances right in the first half. Keeper pulled off a great save uh, from Keats. But um, overall, in the first half, I thought we were poor. We changed the system to three five two. In the second half, we were, we were we were better, but we were always, you know, it's. You know, we just didn't get a hold of the game, and it was just—it just probably got away from us. I suppose the goal coming so soon into the the second half as well, so soon after half time, was a bit of a blow. No, it was—it was a massive blow, and it's um, yeah, it's um, we were poor, as I said, we lost we lost a runner there at the back, and obviously um, Davis Davis got one there at the back post, and he put it in. But it's um, we need to be better there. We need to be better there because we have we have been very very good. Um, just lately, we've been um, we've been switching off on on, on defending corners, so um, we'll have to tighten that up. Well, listen, we got a big game against Galway next week, and we know that they are very very good on set plays, and uh, we need to be we need to be ready for that one. You're looking ahead to that game now. Obviously, tonight is out of the way, and I mean that's a, that's a really big game, probably even a bigger game after the way tonight went. Now, because Galway won, and we got the draw here, so I mean it, it, it's it's a game you have to go up and get something. Now, isn't yeah, it? no, it is, it is, it is. It's as I said, listen, Galway, Galway are flying at the moment. Um, it's a place. Um, it's, it's a tough place to go. Listen, they're a very, very good side. But as I said, we we we'll go up there. We've got a very, very good squad, and we'll go and try and win the game. We went up there last year with a young with a young team, and we got a very good result. Mm-hmm. But um, listen, Galway are a different team this year. They're um, they're a powerful side, and uh, they're um, they're they're a good side. So we'll have to, we'll have to be ready for that. It's the first time in quite a while now. You're not sitting at the top of the league. Will will that play into the players' minds? Do you think? I don't think it will. I don't think it will. Um, listen, there's loads and loads of games left. Um, listen, it's just unfortunate tonight that we just did, we didn't perform. Um, probably, you know, we did no game again. Like we, we played against Bray here the last time, and we we were we were sloppy as well. So I, I don't know if it's, it's that point of view, but it, it, that shouldn't be the case. That shouldn't be the case. But we we we, we weren't at it tonight, and um, listen, we didn't. Um, so we didn't get beaten. We got a point, but we'll um, we look we look forward to next week, and um, hopefully that we can um, go go to Galway and. Won't get to three points. I was going to ask you about that. Do you think the the week off kind of kills momentum? I mean, like he, he came back, you got the late win against that loan, and then you had the week off, and you mentioned like he came back a bit sluggish yeah, against Bray as well after the week it's, off. It's I know every team will have it, but yeah, it kind of disrupts things, it's, doesn't it? It's hard to say. It does, yeah. But you you, you, you need to get on with it. Um, all the teams are in the same in the, in the same boat as us, like so. You need to get on with it. I just um, we were sloppy the last time against Bray, and we were sloppy again here tonight. But listen, you got to give uh, credit to Wexford as well. They they played some good football at times, and they caused us problems. But um, Normally we are better. We weren't tonight, but hopefully, um, come come Friday night against Galway, that we'll be ready for. It's a word for Kevin O'Connor. Great strike with the goal. No, it was a fantastic, fantastic strike, and, and we weren't that um, during the week that we, we can get the ball out wide, where there's a space out wide. But we just didn't do that enough in the first half. Um, listen, Kev got him great technique, and it was a, it was a great finish. Big game next week, as we said. It's a long way to go. It's only like we're only approaching the halfway point yeah, of the yeah, season. I suppose there's yeah. nothing really to get to get worried about. No, 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 not at all, not at all. Just a long way to go. And listen, we go, we, we go up to Galway and um, we go and put on performance. We go and get to three points, and it's um, we have the squad to do it. And um, I have no fear with the boys um, that they'll go up there and they'll put on a good performance. And listen, there'll be a massive crowd up there. We'll, we'll, we'll take our fans up there as well, and they'll be they'll be loud as they always are. And then it's one that it'll be um, it'll be it'll be a great game.